Hi there, this is Kawa, back with another episode of Siege World Battlefield. Hmm. Yeah, I think we'll call it episode. It's, yeah, yeah, we'll call it episode, moving forward. Uh, so today's team is going to be a Lightning Main team. Uh, I have considered that I will play Lightning Main now, moving forward, seeing I already feel like I have a really good understanding of how Water Main works, and I don't really need to delve any deeper into her interactions. So I want to start doing lightning main. Um, I started this game as a lightning main, and I always wanted to make him work. He was a thing when uh, Death Position Hidan was really popular back in 2.0. That was one of my favorite teams. That was the first thing I made uh, when I had the chance, and it was just so fun for me. Um, and then he just like fell off. Actually, he didn't fall off. I saw the um, a video back in the day from uh, Fu Kenson, where they sh showcased a uh, Chaos Water team, and I just fell in love with it, and I instantly started working towards it from that point forward, and never turned back until now. Um, I'm gonna play this Lightning Man here, and we're gonna see how it goes. So more on the team. Uh, it's obviously, as you can see, it's going to be a team with Killer B as the move one. Uh, I'm using Mifun here. He has not seen use in ages. I feel like the last time I used him was probably with um, Death Possession Hidan. It's been a long time. Uh, uh, he's really here just to buff B, and um, he has this nice. I like it, the fact he has a double attack. Um, and his mystery is not interruptible, and he removes all buffs, which makes him really unique, but he becomes a lot, lot better when he gets skill books. But seeing as we don't have it yet, he's okay only. Nothing to really praise about him. Uh, my last unit here is Sakura, uh, the cloaked one. Uh, I'm not sure is she the right one for this team. I was considering between her and the summer one. Uh, she's this one I decided to use because she could be a semi tank and uh, she has scaling damage when she takes damage and her slugs can actually hit relatively hard and it also helps the fact that uh, when B takes a hit from Taijutsu damage he lowers the resistance which would in turn buff her uh, slug so this is the team that I'm playing for today um, let's see how we do should be relatively decent I hope so I also want to mention that today I'm gonna to try something slightly new uh, I'm gonna pop in occasionally and um, put in some commentary during the fights um, maybe talk about some teams I run into my likes and dislikes about them and yeah just put in my two cents So this is a classic uh, lightning beam blitz team. You obviously have your three buffs here, well, two, and a barrier from Shisui. Relatively basic. If I was any weaker or if he was any stronger than me, well not stronger than me, but any stronger, he would definitely have killed my Mifu. Hmm. 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 
行くわよ。So this is a relatively classic um, water team. I personally do not like it at all because you can never trigger this Roshi here. It's really bad. There's no reason for this Roshi to be here outside of being, I guess, the move two tank. But he can never chase, so I never like it. I always prefer to have some DPS here instead of a tank. But that's just me. This team, I gotta instantly tell you, I do not like it because Iruka here is a move 4. There is literally no reason for him to be here as a move 4. He'll probably be better as a move 2. Because at move 4, you're not interrupting crap. And the reason why I can be at move 4 with Lightning Lean in the acupuncture is the difference is I have an acupuncture and he has an interrupt. I can just tag you at the end of the round if you can't cast. In the next round, but his interrupt, he has to catch you casting, and at move four, you're not catching nothing.
a nice chase, but I don't like the fact that Naruto is not part of it. If Naruto is at least part of it, he, he can get a CC out of it. So in these situations where you spot like a Anbu Itachi with another Uchiha member, you usually should go after him first and kill them. Um, if you don't think you can kill him, you should probably go after the lightning. But I'm pretty sure I'll burst him pretty fast, he'll die in the next round. Uh, that was a terrible choice. Uh -huh, to go after my B because now they're all losing resistances for trying to kill him, and he just loses a lot during the chase. See, I just one shot at that. Well, he was about half life, <laughs> and because he lost so much resistance, he just slapped and he died. <laughs> Yeah, my Sakura is still a little bit too weak right now. She's a move 3 and her stats are just really low. If she was a little stronger, she could take some more beat down. <laughs> I won't be surprised if, if he survives the next round. B does like about 20k to him. Point seven, close enough. Now, this chaos water team, I can get on board with. Has all the bases covered, but sadly, he is slower than me, so he has no say in the matter. I would say I would replace the Sakura with the summer one if possible. It's a way better healer. I don't like the Rhino chase because the Sakura really didn't need to be involved. It probably would have been way better if he was just using uh, King of Hell or the guy's turtle. If he doesn't have them, if he doesn't, then it'll make more sense. Yes. <laughs> Uh, should be game over now. Oh, I did that crit apparently.
I also have to say, now that I've seen his team again, I don't understand really the lightning armor. It, it could have just been uh, like in the slash that I'm using, it would make more sense. Because you're not really doing much as damage as a move 3. And I just undid all of Naruto's villain. One swing of Beast Tail. So, for this team, uh, I have a main dislike of it, ignoring the fact that the, there's a fire main on the move 1 slot. I dislike it when people do this swordsman team and they bring Sasori. It's just my personal preference that when Jinpachi does his double attack passive, he should always give it to Kushimaru. But when there's three Edo Tensei people, there's a chance he doesn't give it to Kushimaru. And it's just something I personally don't like. I like that Kushimaru always gets it. Um, I understand that Sasori is here to give you buffs, but I feel like you can use someone else, maybe like Mifu, but then you can't take root, so it becomes a little weird. So maybe like a barrier. Uh, a barrier maybe from Onuki. I like Onuki's barrier, it's pretty good. Um, it gets all of them buffed, and it doesn't interfere with the Edo Tensei and uh, the Swordsman. It's not personal in a long time. So I also want to mention, my setup being like this scattered, it supposed to insulate you against uh, Hiruzen, because he attacks rolls. So by having them split up, he can only at most attack two people. So we already seen what the fire means can do, so we're just going to ignore him and try to kill his as fast as we can. I believe in a 1v1 fight between B and Rosen. Uh, B should win because his resistance is getting shredded by B. Oh, 
But I could be wrong. Let's find out. Okay, so that's 1v4 right now. Uh, they're all gonna die as soon as V gets to Mishiri. So it should be a 1v1. Well, 1v1 until Sasori gets back up. Oh, I guess he survives. I guess I just didn't crit him? So I'm probably going to lose this now, because Sasori's going to get up now. He's going to reestablish the shield. He's going to mystery and... Clobber me? Yeah, I'm probably going to lose this. Like, the one downside is that B doesn't heal himself. But yeah, with a 20k power difference? I suspect it as much. In these high-powered fights, it really is the one who crits is the one who wins. If you're not critting, you're not winning. So, I'd say I don't like this team. Because this Itachi here is pretty forced. You're going for a lightning armor team. But you have an Asuma, but you have no shields to protect your HP. So if someone's faster than you, you lose that buff instantly. So this Asuma becomes relatively worthless. And you're not really doing anything with that extra 20 chakra. If this was Iruka, which is the standard um, lightning blitz team, you at least can use all that chakra. Wow, everybody seems to be surviving with a little bit of HP today. Not really much to say here outside the fact that uh, Sage Naruto is a little bit outdated. Most people, I would think, have the uh, Karama Cloak Naruto right now, or at least is really close to pulling it. Um, Sage Naruto is not good for damage. His clone is very tanky, I'll give you that, but that's about it. He's not very good anymore. I'm just gonna mystery on Gara to send a message. <laughs> He's 
So it seems like my crit rate is really low on move ones these days. I have to look into that. This, I know for a fact my crit is about 24,000. Uh, I guess people started catching up, so my 24,000 is not good enough anymore. I'm about to strive for that 26,000 crit. Granted, though, I don't really know where I can find more crit right now. Well, I do know, but I don't think there's a easily accessible spot that I can find that crit at. Is what I really should say. Oh, 10 seconds on the clock. I guess all these monsters are just staring at each other. I'll join in the staring contest. Oof, that loss to, um, it's not personal, it'll put me below second. Eh, oh wells. I'll live. <laughs> and that concludes today's Stage Worlds.